just a update on the hiking kit. Okay, so far, it's been a while. This is kind of what it should look like. Got your paracord wrapped around there. Um, one side, you got a couple Altoid cans. One with Altoids in it. So I haven't gotten to that yet. And here's an empty one. Uh, in the future, I'll show you a way to make a fire kit using that. Okay, I'm setting up some new stuff, so we'll go through it as I come across. You should already have your knife and a ferro rod you should have, which I don't have in this one. I'm setting up new little first aid kit. Uh, there's nothing fancy about this other than it just fits into the pocket about perfect. Um, real, real basic. It only came with a couple band-aids, some uh, hand cleansing wipes, and a gauze pad. Um, I recommend it. I may do a short video on it. I recommend modifying it, um, such as if you can have Advil or aspirin or something, toss a small container in there. Um, extra band-aids, of course. Uh, see, triple antibiotic, stuff like that. Okay. Going on, I'm sending a small bundle of, uh, this is fat wood. This is wood from a evergreen tree, like a pine tree that's died, the tree's fallen down. The resin collects inside like the, the unions, the joints of the branches where they meet the trunks, stuff like that, and sometimes in the trunk. And you can find it, uh, cut it up, and it makes a great fire starter. I always try to have some of that on me. Also, I'm sending up a Stanley water bottle. Single wall, stainless steel. All the plastic comes off, so if you need to heat it up, you can stick it in a fire. Lid clamps on, screws on like that, and then the top part pulls off, so you have this nice little easy spout to drink out of instead of dumping it all over your face or whatever. But handy. Uh, and I'll show you how to cook with that at some point. And then a cheapo plastic cup. Rubber cup? I don't know. I guess it's rubber. Folds up, fits into the bottom perfect. About the right diameter. The bottom of the bag. Ball goes on top. I'm also going to send up a bandana, which I don't have in here yet. They haven't come in, the ones I ordered. And I feel like there's something else. I don't remember. Anyway, just real simple things. First aid kit, always good to have on you. Um, fire starting kit. Uh, I think I'm setting up a, a couple of small Bic lighters to toss in the fire kit. So they have those when we do, them, do a video here on that. And hopefully I'll get to that pretty soon. And that's all. Everything should fit fine into the bag. And zip it up and you're good to go. Thanks for watching. Uh, I may extend this video a little bit longer. Uh, possibly when I get home. Just out camping. Finishing up my weekend camping. We're supposed to get some big thunderstorms in tonight. Uh, While well, starting around 3. It's probably a little before noon right now. So I'm actually folding up and getting ready to go home. The last couple days, just me and the dog. You probably heard him behind you scratching. And uh, I don't know. Other than that, it's been nice. A little bit of rain last night, but... Not, not too much. I'm just waiting for the tent to dry out, so I haven't folded it up yet. That's all. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.
out on the bike today. Uh, just hitting some dirt roads. And I figured I'd finish this video. This is the bag I'm sending out to my niece and nephews. Just a bag I use for gym bag, but I don't need any more, so I'll pass it on. All right, inside the bag, let's start off with uh, some of these zip fire starters. Just a, a box of fire starters, just something to play with to get used to uh, keeping a sustaining fire. Uh, no sense learn how to start a fire if you can't keep the fire burning, so I figure maybe I'll, I'll do a video on keeping a sustaining fire and then get to the fire starting parts of it. Okay, also in here I have bandanas and there's enough for everybody in here for uh, my niece and nephews. Should be four of them, but they're big, orange, there's tons of uses for bandanas, camping, hiking, survival, whatever you want to do. Uh, unfortunately, I bought the wrong ones. And these are 100% polyester instead of cotton. Cotton would be better, uh, but that'll work for now. Okay, also, a bundle of fat wood. This gives you something good to play with, use. All right. Now we got cups, similar to my cup. I'm making tea down here, so I got that ready. So all of them are getting a cup. We're getting water bottles. These are the Stanley stainless steel water for the road, it says. Um, fairly lightweight, the caps are the heaviest. Uh, they do untwist here, small nozzle, untwist here, and you could use it over fire or camp stove single walled not a problem there thought these were nice got a good deal on them anyway so here we use them so there's four of those in there four okay uh, pack of lighters for the fire kits these are the small Bic lighters I use them probably the most myself and last thing in here is a book this is just on North American wildlife uh, my mom had this book when I was growing up I have a copy of this myself at home now and I just want to pass along another copy this is a nice little book for identifying pretty much anything you can think of out there plants animals snakes birds so on and so forth uh, pretty nice little book though that's North American wildlife so passing all this stuff along to my niece and nephews to add to their hiking kits which I did not bring mine with me today um, but you'll have that I'll do some follow-up videos on fire kits I'll do some videos on cooking with these water bottles I don't know if I'm gonna fit everything in here now as well as fire uh, fire starting and uh, using fat wood I love the smell of that more about fire starting bandanas tons and tons and tons and tons of uses for these from hiding in the shade you know put it over your head so you don't get burnt to making a, a sling for your arm or a stint or a fire starter or um, collecting water off a of dew uh, just almost uncountable uses for these so for everything going out uh, and I do get my uh, older nephew to get some of this stuff too so that would be five of at least some of it big stuff anyway I don't know how interested he is in this stuff anymore but there's that and now I'm just uh, waiting for my tea to steep swatting some bugs. Thanks for watching. I'll watch for the next video soon, hopefully.